Welcome, in front of me is a Realme 8 and today I'll show you how to bypass the Google verification on this device. So obviously you can see the phone right here is locked and I could unlock it using either the previously logged in Google account or if I go back and using the previously set uh, pattern in this case here. Just give it a second, yeah, there we go. So assuming we don't know either of those, we can bypass this by well, basically going back now let's back out to the first page. First page. And here you can see uh, we have the option for emergency call. So once you tap on it, uh, what you want to do now is type in a code. So this is gonna be star hash 813. And once I press the hash again, uh, it's gonna accept it. So you need a moment to write it down. Make sure you just pause the video. So, there we go. So from here, as you can see, it just closes up the setup. And what we can do is pull down notification panel, go to the settings. From here, you wanna scroll down to additional settings and find the backup and reset right at the bottom and choose erase all data factory reset again erase all data erase all data and once more and there we go so what is happening right now is the device is basically performing a factory reset um, the difference here uh, probably comparing it to the previous one is when factory reset is being done through settings, uh, it just removes everything, including Google accounts, protection, anything like that. So once the once the process is finished and we're back in the setup screen, uh, the device has basically no data about the previous account that was logged in, so it won't ask us to verify anything. So let's just simply wait for this to finish, and once we're back in the setup screen, I'll come back and finish it up. And as you can see, the process is now finished, so I'm gonna go through a quick setup. Uh, but like I basically mentioned before, the device uh, is now fully unlocked, so you can set it up however you like. Um, I'm gonna be doing it basically by skipping everything, but if you want, you can log into your Google accounts and do all that stuff. Basically, everything is op optional as it would normally be when the device is brand new. And there we go, that's the setup. So that is how you would bypass the Google verification on this Realme device. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.